Pathways to Hope is a two-day convention being held in Abilene to help spread awareness about mental illness. KTEX's reporter Brenna Gibbons has more on the importance of this issue here at home. One in five U.S. adults live with mental illness. Pathways to Hope is here to provide resources and a community for people who may be struggling. Well, this is our second year of hosting the Pathways to Hope conference. We are partnering with the National Alliance to mental, of Mental Illness, which is our national organization. We are one of 14 state and uh, local affiliates across the nation that are holding this uh, event simultaneously. The theme for this year's convention is where faith and science intersect. The goal is to help our underserved communities to reach out to their faith-based communities for more mental health services and to help our faith-based communities know that we are available and that we have programs here at NAMI that can help bridge that gap. Lisa Kurjean, an attendee of the convention, says she has found a community through these organizations. So many times people think if you have a mental illness you're crazy and you're not really. It's a neurochemical problem in most cases and um, medication is probably one of the cures. Some faith-based um, people say that God will help you and that's another source of strength. But when I come to things like this, I realize I'm not alone, that there is hope, there is help, and the Abilene community is a great place to recover. Kurjean hopes for more people to try and understand mental illnesses. Anytime you have education on something, it makes people more aware of what the truth of something is. And so if you can find out the truth behind mental illness and find out what's going on, a lot of it is hereditary, some of it is from trauma, and uh, soldiers have PTSD, but so do kids who are abused. So do wives that have been beaten or men that have been beaten. So, you know, it just depends on what the source of stress and trauma is um, that will cause the mental illness. You are not alone. And if there is a concern, reach out for help. Don't hide in the shadows. Ask for help because you aren't alone. If you or someone you know is struggling with mental health, you can contact NAMI at 1-800-950-6264. In Abilene, I'm Brenna Gibbons, KTexas News. Brenna, thank you. You can also call the Suicide and Crisis Lifeline at 988 or go to 988lifeline.org.